What is up everybody? Juliana is back at it again with another video for you guys. Um, so today I will be reviewing this awesome set. I don't have all of the ones from the set just because they take out so many exclusives. They take out so many of the same pops because they took out another movie. So I'm just collecting what I want from the set because as you guys know, as I've stated before, I'm not interested in having like every single pop from one line. Um, but this set does mean a lot to me. That's why I've been trying to collect most of them. Um, but before that, before we get into this, I want to give a shout out to Mama Cinco because it's almost her birthday. Yay. Um, she is also doing a giveaway for her birthday. So go follow her on Instagram. I'll put her Instagram down below so you guys could go check that out. And if you already subscribed to me and following me on Instagram, all you got to do is like one more thing, I think. So go check it out because it's just super easy. And um there's actually some really cool stuff we're giving away. I'm sponsoring one of the prizes, so you might as well just go check it out, you guys. Um, I know you guys like all of our giveaways, so this one won't disappoint. Um, but yeah, so without further ado, let's get started. So um, here is the line that we'll be reviewing today. Um, I know you guys can't see it because there's kind of a glare, but I'll take them down. So I only have five of these pops. Um... I believe from this set, I only want three more and that, or would it be three more? Let's see. Yes, three more. So the ones I want and I'll continue to keep on looking for will be Mater, Doc Hudson, and um, Cruz Ramirez. Because those are the only three that I would want from this set because they're kind of just like the main characters. Um, but I think I got some of the pretty, pretty cool exclusives. So... Let's get into it. So first, I want to start off with the two brothers. Um, we have Guido and Luigi. Now, the story behind these two is I did not get these from the same person. Um, first, I had traded. My first ever trade was for Guido, or excuse me. My first ever trade was for Luigi, and that was for like an out-of-box pop and a pocket pop. Um, I traded this lady, and she was more than happy to send him to me. And... He is super cool, and when I got him, this was the first car pop I had got. When I had got him, I thought he was so cool. I was like, you know what? I can't have him without Guido. And I had seen um, that a really good friend of mine, Carmen not from San Diego, um, Carmen Clement, also known um, on YouTube, she was kind enough to send him down to me, and I kind of helped her out with one of her raffles, and you know, it was like a win-win situation. So. She was kind enough to send him to me, and I just, I couldn't have, like I said, Luigi without Guido. So I had to ask her, and she was nice enough to do that for me. So thanks, shout out to her. Thank you so much. Now I have the two bad boys. Um, if you guys aren't familiar with the movie and not to spoil it so much, these are two brothers, and they own, like, a tire shop, and they're, like, Italian, so... That's awesome. <laughs> They're funny. They're funny. You guys, you guys just have to see it. I can't, I can't spoil it. All right. Now, next, we'll be doing Ramon. Now, this is the only pop I have that's from the first line because they did come out with the first line. And I believe the first line had, yep, they're back here. So, it had um, Lightning McQueen, Mater, Ramon, and Doc Hudson. Now, the only two I'd want from this older line would be Mater, Doc Hudson, and from the new line would be Cruz Ramirez. This Lightning McQueen I already have from the newer set, and I, I mean, what am I going to do with two of them? I believe they're the same mold as well, so I'm not interested in really him from the older set. As long as I have one, I'm cool with that. But here he is, Ramon, and... I was talking to a friend of mine, a fellow pop collector. You all know her, RBG herself, the queen. Um, and we were talking how this pop is a glitter pop. Let's, let's see. Yeah, it's a glitter pop. Um, but this pop isn't considered a diamond pop. Just the vinyl itself is glitter. But that's so cool because I haven't seen um, a lot of pops that glitter without being considered a diamond pop and he is glitter all the way around except his flames and the tires but otherwise he is glitter everywhere and hopefully you guys can see that pretty good um but yeah so he's really cool 
He's the only pop I have from that very first drop that they did of these. And I'm looking to get two from this set still, Doc and Mater. And then from the other line, I'll show you guys right now, just Cruz Ramirez. Cause I already have this Lightning McQueen. All I'm missing from this set is her. Because I know they did come out with, <clears throat> I believe they came out with two exclusives, but to some cons and they're like a thousand, a thousand. They're not too high pops either, but they just don't interest me as much, I don't know. Um, now next, this I think might have to be one of my favorite pops from the line just because, and I don't know why I don't have that this pop yet, the Hudson Hornet pop. It just hasn't come across me um just yet to be able to trade for so i had i don't have it yet but i was i was able to get the next best thing and without spoiling too much of the movie i'll try to share something about his background why lightning mcqueen is blue um so here's the fabulous lightning mcqueen in his um royal blue with uh burgundy tires this is the same mold as the other lightning mcqueen they're just painted differently and this was a toys at rest only exclusive of course here in the states we don't have a toys R Us anymore so that was awesome i was able to get my hands on this one he is exactly the same except he has written on him obviously a different design he still has the Rusty's logo right on his hood and the background with him being this color and you know saying the fabulous lightning mcqueen is um spoiler so zoom ahead okay you should have had enough time now doc hudson passes away and he was the fabulous hudson hornet so in honor of him he decided to go blue and have the same sort of font and style as he did because he ends up training cruz ramirez and there was just like this whole background story um that just watch the movie, you guys. Just watch it. That's, um, I believe, yeah, that's Cars 3. You'll see all that mumbo jumbo. But anyways, last but not least, we have Lightning McQueen. Now, this is the pop that I was talking to you guys about that I didn't want the one from the newer set because I already have him and I like how he is. So he is just regular Lightning McQueen. This is not the metallic version. The metallic version is cool. I'd like to have it. But it's not something, if it doesn't come across me, I probably won't pay for it. Because um, I already have this one. So here is um, the Lightning McQueen. He has the same mold as the fabulous Lightning McQueen. Except he's a little different. If you guys heard that outside, I'm pretty sure that's my dad. So you could tell how much my dad loves cars. Um, and for those of you who didn't know, my dad's also a mechanic. So this these pops mean a lot to me. Because they're cars. I like cars. My family likes cars. Kind of makes sense. But yeah. So I'm only missing three more from this set. And I'll keep an eye out for them. If you guys see them. You know. You could let me know. Send me a DM. That'd be awesome. So thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know down in the description below. Which one was your favorite. And don't forget to thumbs up this video. And go follow Mama Cinco for her giveaway. Thank you guys so much. And I see my phone is moving down little by little. So it looks like the time is gone. See you guys on the next one. Peace.